Well, he has time. He's flushed out. Mustafa Johnson chasing him as he throws back and gets the green and picked off again. Darnell Sankey. How do you go to the Grey Cup? Get nine takeaways in a game. Amazing job by Montreal's defense. Let's break down the interceptions through the course of the game. Here you're going to see a seven-up look. Everybody at the line of scrimmage, seven players. It's cover zero or man across the board. Jack Kelly wants to throw to Tommy Neal coming across the field, but his rule has to be this. He has to see the end man on the line of scrimmage. If he goes straight to the quarterback, it's going to prevent him from throwing this crossing route because he's going to be blind. Right here, he can't see what Duquois is doing. He should have handed the ball off because that player played contain on the quarterback that would have given an option to be able to run the ball. The ball may score. So I, a bad decision there, uh, and Duquois is such a great football player. Uh, it makes the play. This next one, this is a second and extra. You're going to see two vertical routes and then kind of a post in the middle of the field. They're trying to get it over the top of the strong side linebacker. And watch. It's double field's a strong side linebacker. He's three to four yards inside and he's deep. The ball should have gone to the check down on the outside instead of trying to force it over the top of stubble field. He's been instinctive all year. Easy interception for him. Now, when you are on the move and things, just throw the ball away here. You cannot throw the ball and across the field in a bad situation like he does there. And this last one, he's trying to throw to his left as he's climbing. He's got a guy, A.J. Oletz, wide open to the left. He can't find his second read, but then watch. KB and Ento recognizes he's going to try to throw it to the wide side of the field. The problem with that is the ball is too long in the air. Ento's right there. Outstanding job by the defense.